Hello guys, welcome to the Science Tutor YouTube channel. Today our lesson is concept of mole and molar mass. Before I start the lesson, I kindly invite if you are not subscribed to our channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button. The molar concept is an easy way of measuring the amount of substance. A measurement can be divided into two parts. What are those two? Those two are the numerical value and the unit of that numerical value. As an example, if we go to the supermarket and buy two kilograms of sugar, the numerical value is two and unit is kilogram. When scientists are dealing with particle in atomic and molecular level, one gram of pure substance contains large number of particles. As an example, if we take one gram of gold, it contains a very large number of atoms. Thus, the molar concept is used by scientists to dealing with large number of particles. One mole is equal to 6.022 10 to the power 23. Actually, the mole is also just a number, like pair, dozen, gross. For example, one pair of shoes means two shoes. One dozen of eggs means 12 eggs. Likewise, one mole of gold means 6.022 10 to the power 23 of gold atoms. One mole of anything contains 6.022 10 to the power 23 of that thing. And always this number is constant. So, this number is also called as Avogadro constant and denoted as Na. Now, let's see what is the exact definition of mole. The mole is defined as the number equal to the number of carbon atoms in exactly 12 grams of pure carbon 12. If we measure exactly 12 grams of carbon 12 isotopes, it contains 6.022 10 to the power 23 carbon 12 atoms. That means 1 mole of carbon atoms. So, the definition of mole is number equal to the number of carbon atoms in exactly 12 grams of pure carbon 12. Now, you have an idea on what is a mole. Mole is just a number and it is 6.022 10 to the power 23. Now let's identify what is molar mass. Although one mole of different substance always have the same number of particles, the mass of one mole of different substance are various. So the molar mass is mass of one mole of substance and usually measured in grams per mole. For example, mass of one mole of carbon is different from mass of one mole of oxygen. If we take one mole of from each of 10 different substances, they have 10 different mass even though they have same number of particles of each. Also, the molar mass of pure elements equal to atomic mass of that elements. Let's look at some example. By using the periodic table, we can say that atomic mass of carbon is 12. So, the molar mass of carbon is 12 gram per mole. Same as the atomic mass of oxygen is 16. So, the molar mass of oxygen is 16 gram per mole. Also, the atomic mass of calcium is 40. So, the molar mass of calcium is 40 gram per mole. Now, let's consider how to calculate the molar mass of compound. We can calculate the molar mass of compound by using three simple steps. What is first? First, list the number of atoms of each element. Then, multiply the number of each element by its atomic mass. And finally, add up all masses and add units. For example, let's consider how to calculate molar mass of ammonia. 
as we know one molecule of ammonia contains one nitrogen atom and three hydrogen atom so the molar mass of ammonia equal to 1 multiplied by atomic mass of nitrogen plus 3 multiplied by atomic mass of hydrogen. By using the periodic table, the atomic mass of nitrogen is 14 and the atomic mass of hydrogen is 1. So, the molar mass of ammonia is 17 gram per mole. Let's look at another example. How to calculate the molar mass of calcium carbonate? So we can see one molecule of calcium carbonate consists with one calcium atom, one carbon atom and three oxygen atom. So the molar mass of calcium carbonate equals to one multiplied by atomic mass of calcium plus one multiplied by atomic mass of carbon plus 3 multiplied by atomic mass of oxygen. The atomic mass of calcium is 40 and the atomic mass of carbon is 12 and atomic mass of oxygen is 16. By solving, this gives as 100. So, the molar mass of calcium carbonate is 100 gram per mole. If you enjoyed this video, click the like button and share with your friends. Also, follow us on these social media. See you with a new video. Thank you.